Le point est de la vie. Little India was a scene of chaos on Sunday nights as 300 police officers came face to face with some 400 people involved in the riot. Vehicles were smashed, flipped on their sides and even set on fire. The incident was sparked off by a fatal accident involving a 33-year-old Indian national who was knocked down by a private bus along Racecourse Road. The Singapore Civil Defence Force said in a statement that things were thrown at the SEDF rescuers while they were extricating the body. At a press conference held at 2.15am on Monday, Deputy Commissioner of Police T. Raja Kuma said that 27 people were arrested for the incident which started at about 9.30pm. Deputy Prime Minister Teo Chi Hien said at the press conference that the government will not tolerate such lawless behaviour. I've asked the police to investigate the matter thoroughly and deal with all aspects of this incident and all persons involved strictly, firmly and fairly according to our laws. And I ask uh, members of the public uh, to stay calm, not to react to any speculation and let the facts be established. The incident that happened um, last night is intolerable. Uh, wanton violence, rioting, destruction of property, fighting the police, it's not the Singapore way. And the police will spare no effort first to identify and then we will find and then we will arrest and then we will prosecute everyone who is involved in tonight's or in yesterday's uh, violence. 18 people, including police officers and four SCDF personnel, were sent to Tan Tok Seng Hospital for treatment. More than 10 police and private vehicles were damaged. Eyewitnesses in the area reported that the rioters were throwing everything in sight, including a fridge. They tried to throw away my things. I told them, stop, stop, they coming to hit me. But at last, they said, you better run, that's why I run. Five or six Indian, he destroy everything. Whatever he seen in the eyes, he take, he take the bottle, he smash everything. Then he take the bottle, he go and throw at the civil defense uh, car, he throw everything. In a Facebook post, Prime Minister Lee Hsien Long called the riot a grave incident adding that there is no excuse for such violent, destructive and criminal behaviour. Members of the public with any information of the riots are advised to call the police at 1-800-255-0000.